are Alpha and Omega. We worship you, our Lord. You are worthy to be free. We give you all, we give you all. So there is no one like you. We say, Alpha and Omega. Oh yeah. There is no one like you. So we'll let your name. I am. Baba 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 Shendori Anara. I am. We plan the basso che plana. I am. We get the basso che la plana casona. I am. I am. I am. Almighty Father, we bless your holy name. We lift your name. Can you lift up your voice and worship the Almighty God, our Maker, our Creator, our Savior, our Redeemer, the God that answers prayer, the one that fights our battle, the Jehovah, the Man of War, the Captain of the Lord of Hosts. The one that never lost any war before. Can you open your mouth and thank him for counting you among the living this morning? That you are hale and hearty, that you are alive this morning. Can you open your mouth and appreciate him for the mercy of seeing another day? Oh, give God glory this morning. Give God glory this morning. Give God honor this morning. Give God adoration this morning. Because our God desires to be praised, our God desires to be honored. Oh, my riba take a shenta lima ma si prande kakaba shenta lia. Thank him, thank him, thank him for his covenant keeping God. Thank him for covenant of mercy, covenant of covenant of protection, covenant of victory, covenant of life. I appreciate God for covenant of divine health and healing, covenant of divine provision and abundance. I appreciate God this morning. I appreciate God for all He is doing and all He has done. Thank you for all you will yet to do. Hey, Masika Labash and Talia. Lord, we say thank you. Almighty Father, we say thank you. King of glory, we say thank you. Oh, ancient of day, we say thank you. Masupa Lebre de Kasun Talia. Daddy, we say thank you. Can you appreciate him for the grace to wait upon him? For our spending that are waiting upon him. Can we thank God for strength? Can we thank God for strength, for strength, for strength? For not allowing us to faint. 
Oh, my river to Gashen Talimama. Daddy, we are grateful to you. Almighty Father, we are grateful to you. Hey, Jesus, most wonderful name, we have worship. There is power, power, wonder, walking power. In the blood, in the blood of the Lamb. There is power, there is power, power, wonder, walking power. In the precious blood of the Lamb. I want you to lift up your voice loud and clear and say, Father, I plead the blood this morning. The blood that speaks better thing than the blood of Abel. Let the blood speak on my behalf. Let the blood speak mercy. Let the blood speak forgiveness. Let the blood speak vengeance against powers of the enemy. Let the blood speak victory. Let the blood speak deliverance. Can you open your mouth and begin to plead the blood? Plead the blood, plead the blood this morning that the blood of the Lamb, the blood that speaks better thing than the blood of Abel, let the blood speak for all this morning. Let the blood speak mercy. Let it speak pardon. Let it speak forgiveness. Oh, that it will plead the blood. By the blood, have mercy, have mercy, have mercy. Pardon all our iniquities and transgression. Even by the blood this morning. Let the blood speak vengeance. For Lord, you will fight for all this morning. Masika la baskaliada. Let the blood speak victory. For we overcame by the blood of the Lamb. Ah, this night, this morning, Lord, we overcome. Pariba te gazanta limama. Kaka ba 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 ba. We silence every voices of opposition by the blood. We silence every satanic altar by the blood. We silence every manipulation by the blood. Kalika kata gazanda. Le kakuka palima santa li. Thank you, mighty Father. Hey, Jesus, mighty name, we are praying. I thought somebody would say a better amen. For it shall come to pass in that day. When is the day? I say, when is that day? I'm reading Jeremiah chapter 30, verse 8. Jeremiah chapter 30, verse 8. For it shall come to pass in that day. See the Lord of hosts. That I will break his yoke from off thy neck, and we burst thy bands, and strangers shall no more save themselves of him. Let somebody shout hallelujah. Beloved, there are several kinds of yokes. There are satanic yoke, ancestral yoke, yoke of failure, yoke of lack, yoke of poverty yoke of death whatever kind of yoke that the lord need to destroy in our life this morning he will arise and destroy in the name of jesus for the word of god have come expressly say for it shall come to pass in that day i pray for you today will be that day for you now lift up your two hands and say oh thou lord of hosts oh great fighter Arise for me. Every satanic yoke, every yoke of the enemy upon my life, destroy them today before they destroy my life. Can you go ahead and touch the mighty God before they destroy your life? Before the yokes of the enemy destroy your life, let God destroy them. Let the Almighty God destroy them. Let the captain of the Lord of hosts destroy them. Brother, are you praying at all? Any satanic yoke over your home, over your family. Oh, every ancestral yoke. <laughs> yoke of poverty, yoke of lack. Command them to be destroyed. Masika <laughs> Rikaka Katega Santa Lepote Gazunta Limama that they break every yoke in our lives. Lord, break every yoke, every yoke, every yoke, every yoke, every yoke, every yoke. Let this day be that day. <laughs> Let this day be that day of your prophecy <laughs> in our lives. Hey, Kelika Kuka Kaka, Jemali Bato Kasantalia. Any yoke that the Lord need to destroy, 
let God destroy them by fire by fire by fire by fire by fire kaka baba shipolema santalia in jesus most wonderful name we have prayed lift up your two hands and say father say father break every bondage in my life and set me free completely oh god my father you are the great deliverer break every bondage in my life and set me free go ahead and talk to the almighty god i had a lot to break every bondage every bondage every bondage every bondage every bondage in your life kakaba baba kasanta limama i somebody praying at all zalika kaposhin telele zelekege Shintelemaska, Palima Mama Cassandra Limama, Sipole, Casunta Blande, in Jesus, my name, we are praying. Lift up your two hands and say, Father, you can do better. Say, Father, whatever it will take, whatever it will cost, let the wicked not prevail over me. Can you go ahead and talk to the Almighty God? Lord, let the wicked not prevail over us this morning, O God. The wicked will not prevail over us. Kara mama 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 mama. Kara baba kaka ba shenteli mama. Oh, Marie pato ka shenteli. Supale brando koto ka shenteli mama. Zali kaka ba re baba ka shenteli. Roko roko to. Zali kaka ba shenteli mama. Skaton do lobo gazanta li mama. Zaza kaka baba shentelele. Koroma te gazanta li. Hey, Jesus, my name, we are praying. Now lift up your two hands and say, My Father, my God. You can do better. Say, My Father and my God. You were the God of first half. And you are still the God of second half. July, August, September, October, November, December. Oh God, my Father let them be far better than the first half for me but then go ahead and talk to the almighty god that's our prayer day and night day and night day and night throughout this week throughout this month that our second half will be better than our first half hey kalima mom that god will show up for us oh july god will show up august god will show up september god will show up october god will show up november god will show up december god will show up let the almighty god show up let the almighty god show up sakada brand the castle talian in jesus mighty name it shall be better then finally lift up your two hands and say father you are the God that ruler in the affairs of men. Take over my day. And let not my enemy hijack my day. Lord, take over my day. And let me assess all my blessings today. Lord, take over my day. And give me pleasant surprises. Lord, take over my day. And prosper the work of my hand. Oh God, my Father, take over my day and let my joy be full. Open your mouth and talk to the Almighty God. <laughs> Lord, take over, take over, take over my day. <laughs> Almighty Father, take over my day. Sikanda le prado kasanta le mama. Zizale batu gaga. Shiponde le mama kasu talia. Daddy, take over my day. Take over my day, take over my day and make it a good day. Take over my day and make it a successful day. Take over my day and make it a day of blessing. Take over my day and cause my joy to be full. Take over my day and send help. Take over my day and command your blessing. Take over my day and give me victory. Ask the Lord to take over your day that the enemy will not hijack your day. You will not be frustrated today. You will not fail today. Kaka Bale Mama Santonia. Ripo tegada jibale gazun tali rakuka vale baba baba kashen tali rika kapala baba baba zale baba 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 apa libato kashipa le pote gazin tali mama hey Jesus most wonderful name we are praying and so much and everlasting Father we say good morning 
the lover of our soul, we appreciate you. Oh, the great provider, we say thank you for meeting us at the point of our need, for supplying all our need. Thank you because you are the all sufficient God. Daddy, we say may your name be praised in the name of Jesus. Lord, we thank you because we are complete in you. And so, Lord, this morning we are asking, let the blood speak for us in the name of Jesus. The blood of the Lamb, the blood of Jesus, the blood that speaks better things than the blood of Abel. Let it speak mercy. Let it speak pardon for our sin. Let it speak deliverance. Let it speak victory. Let it speak vengeance against our enemy. In the mighty name of Jesus. Daddy, is in your name I cry this morning. That is there any satanic yoke? ancestral yoke, yoke of poverty, yoke of affliction upon the life of anyone here this morning. Lord, let them be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Lord, the day you prophesy in your word, let this day be that day for all your children in the name of Jesus. May the Almighty God break every bondage in your life in the name of Jesus. I say, may the Almighty God break every bondage in your life in the name of Jesus. I stand upon the authority of the world and I decree the wicked will not prevail over you. I said the wicked will not prevail over you. I said the wicked will not prevail over you. And as you have handed over your day into the hands of the Lord, in that name that is above every other name, the enemy shall not hijack your day. God will look after you today. Today will be a good day for you. A day of rejoicing for you, a day of glad tidings for you. Today you will not weep. Today you will not mourn. Today you will not sorrow. No evil shall come upon you. No arrow of the wicked shall touch you. Every agenda of the enemy concerning you shall be destroyed. Every gang up against you, the Lord will scatter. The work of your hand will be prosper today. Ah, today you will not end empty-handed. I say you will not end today empty-handed. Today, the Lord will remember you for good. In your place of business, the presence of God will go with you. The Lord will bless the work of your hand. And anything that wants to work against you, let God destroy them in the name of Jesus. And wherever your children may be, in that name that is above every other name, because you are standing here and standing in the car for them, God will favor them. God will help them. God will bless them in the mighty name of Jesus. I decree in your home and in your family, none shall be buried in the name of Jesus. None shall die in the name of Jesus. And whatever it will take, whatever it will cost, may your second heart be far better than your first heart. July, August, September, October, November, December shall be better months for you in the name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Father. For we pray in Jesus' name. I thought someone would say that amen three powerful times. Two. Put those hands together for Jesus. And lift up your right hand and say with me very quickly, I worship the Lord of hosts, the mighty man in battle. The whole earth tremble before him, and no man can withstand his indignation. Forever he is God, and may his name forever be praised. I declare and I confer concerning me and my household that every satanic yoke over our lives shall be completely be shall completely be destroyed. And we shall be set at liberty to fulfill divine mandates of our lives. I declare and I confirm that the yoke of poverty is broken over my life. Yoke of affliction is broken over my life. Yoke of wood and iron is broken over my life. By the reason of the anointing, I declare and I confess 
that I am not a candidate of bondage and captivity. Say that clear. I am not a candidate of bondage and captivity. The Lord has set me free. And I am free indeed. I am free to prosper. I am free to succeed. I am free to reign. I am free to dominate. I am free to be fruitful. I am free to progress. And I am free to enjoy divine blessing. I will finish well. I finish strong. My ending shall be far better than my beginning. I will not go to her. I will reign eternity. I will love the Lord. And I will serve the Lord all the days of my life. In Jesus' name. Why her blind the Holy Ghost Pasuta by Ye Baba? She prune Kasunta Limama Kasanta Li. Rakuka Pale Baba Kasanta Limama Kashentele. Zazali Bato Kapole Mama Kasheta. Tobo Zimale Kate Kashenta Limama. Susali Gade Kaka. Thank you, mighty Father. And so shall it be in Jesus' name. I thought the blog will say better. Amen. The Lord that have heard you spoken it all his years. He will grant to you your confession. He will grant to you your declaration. He will grant to you your proclamation. He will grant to you your decrees. In the mighty name of Jesus. Your confession will not go unanswered. Your confession will surely become testimony. You shall be congratulated. And all shall be well with you. In the name of God the Father. God the Son, God the Holy Spirit, seven thunders, amen. Better, three, four, five, six. Jump on your feet and say, Put your hands together for Jesus. Hallelujah. Is that all you can do? I say, Is that all you can do? Amen and amen and amen. Can I prophesy to the life of somebody? Who is that fellow? Self-destruction shall be the portion of your enemies. Now your amen is standing on one leg. I say self-destruction shall be the portion of your enemy. In other words, your enemies shall destroy themselves. If you are that fellow, say it louder, amen. One more time, put your hands together and shout like a victor. Shout like a champion. Let somebody shout like a winner. Let me be seated in his presence. Complete victory. Our team for the month is Ye are complete in him. If you are complete in him, then your victory must be total. Your victory must be complete. And this morning, you are just listening to part one of this complete victory. Because I am trusting God. Somebody seated here today, ha, you will rejoice. Hmm. Brethren, I say you will rejoice. I hope you will pray today. Exodus 14, 13 and 14. Exodus 13 and 14. And I would love us to read it together. One to go. And Moses said unto the people, Fear ye not, stand still, and see the salvation of the Lord, which he will show to you. When? Oh, the way you are saying it. Is as if now only one person believe. I say when, sir. Why? For the Egyptian whom ye have seen today, ye shall see them again, no more forever. May God grant you complete victory, beloved. Victory can be partial. 
What did I say? Yet celebrated. Victory can be partial. Yet celebrated. But very dangerous. I repeat. Victory at times can be partial. Meaning not complete. Or in other words, victory can be incomplete. Yet celebrated. Yet testimony is given. But very dangerous. And a very good example is what happened in Exodus chapter 12. You read from verse 29 to 36. The children of Israel have been in bondage for over 400 years. Amen? And they have been praying, crying to God to fight their battle, crying to God to deliver them, Cry to God to set them free. Cry to God to give them victory. And of course, God had and gave them a deliverer in the person of Moses. Moses was empowered by God for signs and wonder. His rod became the rod of God. God demonstrated his power that he will show in the life of Moses by asking him to put his hand under his armpit and it became snow and he removed it and it was normal. God promised him of his presence and to deliver the children of Israel. And the good news is that Moses got to Egypt and performed several plagues precisely about 10 of them. Amen. Then on the last night, the children of Israel obtained victory, but unknown to them, it was partial victory. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. In Exodus chapter 12, verse 29 to 36, in the midnight, the Lord of hosts sent the angel of death to pass through the camp of the Egyptians. That fateful night, there was no false bomb, either of human being or of animal that was speared in Egypt. That was victory. Am I correct? Am I correct? Even the gods of the land were judge. Hello? Who was judge? Can I pray for somebody? Your enemy will be judged today. Yeah. Their power will also be judged today. Yeah. You are definitely say louder, amen. Yeah. That same night, they became prosperous. They obtained victory over poverty. Hello? They got their deliverance. While they were rejoicing, the enemy were weeping and mourning. Can I pray for you, sir? This second half of the year, anyone wishing you dead in their home, they will be wailing and crying. All their arrows shall return back to sender. You are definitely let your enemy be louder than your neighbor. So God gave them victory. The same way many of us must have obtained one victory or the other. But unknown to the children of Israel. By the turn of events that later happen makes that victory to be partial victory. Hello? Make the victory to be what? Partial victory. Why? Suddenly, the enemy arose again. To those of you that have only been complaining, have been praying, it's as if the enemy are not leaving me alone. It is their pattern. It is their style. But one thing I can assure you, you can obtain complete victory. Yeah. Only one person said amen. Yeah. If you read verse 5 of Exodus chapter 14, verse 5 of Exodus chapter 14, 
The Bible says, and it was told the king of Egypt that the people fled, and the heart of Pharaoh and of his servant was turned against who? Hello? Huh? Their heart was torn against the people, and they said, Why have we done this? That we have let Israel go from serving us. Why have we done this? Many a time when you win when you win and you obtain victory, your enemy are not happy. They are looking for another way to reattack. That was what happened here. And what did it what what was the result? They began to pursue. Stand on your feet. Envy enemy that pursue you from first half of the year to this second half to see your end. I stand upon this altar, you will see their end. All the enemy that are pursuing you, that have refused to leave you alone, that want to destroy you, that want to ruin you and your family, in that name that is above every other name, you will see their end. Kamalipa Tagazantalia. Thank you, mighty father. Be seated, sir. Be seated, man. So they decided to pursue again. Listen to me, sir. Until the last of your enemy is gone, you are not yet, your victory is not yet complete. Hello? This few days, sir, I stand at the servant of the Most High God. I don't know the battles you are fighting. But in that name that is above every other name, your victory shall be a complete victory. I say your victory shall be a complete victory. Because you are complete in him, your victory shall be a complete victory. As usual of all enemy, Pharaoh took his chariots, took his horses, in other words, he went into his armory and carried all weapons that he knew that he had. Can I pray for you, sir? As from today, every weapon of the enemy shall be of no effect over your life. Because the word of God is the city, no weapon fashioned against thee shall prosper. If you are saying amen, say it like he carry all his weapon, he carry all his army only to pursue those that have no military training, those that have never fought physical war before. They decided to pursue them. Was it not the same people that just obtained victory some few days back? I'm asking, sir. But here are the enemy again pursuing them. And the word of God came, which was our test. God spoke to his servant. He said, No problem. The enemy are coming. But this is going to be the complete victory. This is going to be the final victory. You will see them no more forever. I stand here as the servant of the most high God. All the enemy that have been tormenting your life, you will see them no more forever. You will not see them again forever. I say you will not see them again forever. I say you will not see them again forever. I say you will not see them again forever. I say you will not see them again forever. Every pharaoh of your life, you will not see them again forever. All their weapons, you will not see them again forever. In the name of Jesus. Be seated. Brother, it is real, sir. It is real, man. Because I remember when the battle I was facing was, was, was fierce. When the battle was sore. When nothing was moving. Brethren, there are battles. There are what? Because when you see any man of God that is prayerful, go and ask of his story. And that's why I can tell you for free, you are not wasting your time. God is building you up. I said the Almighty God is building you up. Because a day is going to come. Your enemy will no longer be able to withstand you. But 
too was terrible. Get on praying, fasting. It was as if nothing was moving until one night. Let's just say one night. This will be your own day. This scripture was the confirmation God gave to me. Where I was singing, the song was the, the scripture was converted to song in Yoruba. Oh Baba, oh Baba me, Oba Lagbara, oh Baba, Keke Farao, Keke Farao, Ati Ogunle, Emi Koma. I was carrying a bow. I was singing that song, and I was crying, shedding tear. And I woke up, and I saw water on my face. I am praying for you, sir. All those that have refused to leave you alone. This seventh month, the month of perfection, <laughs> the month of complete in him, God will take over the battle. So, sir, so man, that faithful day that the Lord spoke through Moses, God arose. <laughs> the Lord did what? Huh? Huh? Sir, man. Until you see the end of the pursuers of your destiny, your victory cannot be complete. And your victory can also not be complete until you win spiritually, until you win physically, until you win materially, until you win financially, until you win maritally. Sir, ma, your victory cannot be said to be complete. And that's why the scripture says. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against what? Principalities, against power, against the rulers of darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness. We are in high places. Amen? But the good news is this. There are weapons that match them. And if you read 2 Corinthians chapter 10 verse 4 and 5, it says, for the weapons of our warfare, I know what can I, but what mighty through God for the pulling down of stronghold, casting down imagination, and every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of God and bringing it to captivity, every thought to the obedience of Christ. That will happen in your life, yeah. beloved. It is a dangerous thing to have incomplete victory. <laughs> What did I just say? Sir, incomplete victory is dangerous. Sir, it's even dangerous than having that victory at all. And I'll give you instance in the Bible. In 1 Kings chapter 18, verse 40 to 41, God gave Elijah victory at Mount Carmel. Two of us. Eh? Eh? How many prophets of Baal were slaughtered? 450. Prophet of Baal were what? Were slaughtered. 450. That was what? Victory. And the victory was celebrated. Because immediately after that victory, the man of God said to the king Ahab, he said, go and eat and drink. Hello? Unknown to him. Unknown to Elijah. The anointed Elijah. The fire, fire Elijah. That that victory was what? Partial. Can I pray for you, sir? None of your enemy will escape your sword. Yeah. Do you know what happened? On that fateful day, when the prophet of Baas, all of them were slaughtered, their leader was not present. Their leader was not what? Who was their leader? He, he was not there. And Elijah did not take attention. He did not take cognizance that she was not present. Because she was supposed to be slaughtered also that day. And what happened? Ahab got to. And Ahab was eating and drinking and celebrating. And he, she looked at him. You are eating and drinking. What, what, what happened? What, what, what are you just now? You yeah, are celebrating. Celebrating what? That Elijah is not in charge. Don't worry. 
by verse 9, by chapter 19. Chapter 19, verse 1 to 3. Let us read it together. And they have told Jezebel all that Elijah had done, and with that how he has slain all the prophets with what? With his sword. Then Jezebel sent a message. She did what? To who? To the one that have just won. Saying, so let the gods do to me. And more also, if I make not thy life and the life of the one of them by tomorrow about this time. Oh, Ferege. The anointed man of God ran. Hello? Sir, every enemy you have been running away from, in that name that is above every other name, your victory shall be complete. Sir, ma, partial victory is dangerous. But then listen to me very carefully. Because we are talking about warfare here. Partial victory is what? Do you know why? If you don't win the battle complete, they wait for you in your future. They wait for you, eh? In your future. Every enemy waiting for you in your future. Die by fire. I said, die by fire. I said, die by fire. They wait for you in future. When your victory is not complete, if it is half, if it is partial, the enemy are still waiting. That's why many of you today, you are fighting the battle your parents did not win. And if you two did not win, your children will fight the battle. So that's why I am praying for you. Your victory will be complete. Yeah. Number two, danger of incomplete battle. You become relaxed thinking that they have left you alone. Two of us. You become relaxed thinking, oh, all is well, unknown to you. That they are still at war with you. That's why, sir. Don't rejoice before the victory. Number three, when you have incomplete victory, you are only postponing the evil day. They are still coming. Look at Jezebel. Praise the Lord. Do you now know the worst of it? If you if your victory is incomplete. You may commit suicide. That's why you see some people, they get to a stage in their life, they say, I am tired. I am what? Life is not worth living anymore. What am I living for? Two of us. Sir, that was what happened to Elijah. God later saw Elijah. Elijah, what are you doing here? He was completely discouraged. He said, Listen, I am the only one man standing for you. God, do any other person. He said, Take my life. If an anointed man of God can get to that level, how much more you and I? Brethren, I have good news for you. How what? God will arrest for you. Yeah. Let me stop here. Stand on your feet. We'll continue here tomorrow. We are still talking about complete victory. I beg of you, sir. Don't take this thing for granted. If God should open your eyes to understand what I am sharing with you, sir, there is no one that is not fighting one battle or the other. Not to see yourself. Even when you are not willing to fight, they are ready to fight you. And they fight in so many ways. Tomorrow I'm going to tell you the different battles that many are fighting. And do you know what? When God wants to fight for you, he has all kinds of weapons. God has all manners of missiles. All manners of what? And when he began to fight for you, God can fight with wind. 
God can use the ground to fight for you. God can use the stars. God can use the hailstone. God can send his angel. God can use water. Whatever God wants to use to fight for you this morning, your enemy will not escape. I say your enemy will not escape. God can use earthquake to devastate your enemy. Amen. You want to take a song because you cannot fight for yourself. You cannot do what? You cannot do what? You cannot fight for yourself. But God will fight for you. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take over. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take over. Uh -uh. Holy Ghost, take over. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take over. Take over my battle. Holy Ghost, take over. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take over. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take over. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take over. The Bible says, We don't know what we ought to pray. He said, But the Spirit helped our infirmity. We groan it that cannot be uttered. Sir, it is better you allow the Holy Ghost to help you this morning. We have just a few minutes and we'll be on our way. Sir, ma, all I know is that God will take over the battle. And with the little you have had this morning, even when you leave here, thank God we are waiting. Thank God we are fasting. Thank God we are telling God that our second heart, listen to me, cry to God for complete victory. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, 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 you are still somewhere else, you are not yet here. I want you to close your eyes. Clap your hand and sing that song. I don't know the battle you are fighting, but the Holy Spirit know all things. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take over my battle, Holy Ghost, take in the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take in the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take in the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take in the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost, take over. Lift up your voice and say, Father! Say, Father! You are my fighter! I have the power of my own! Ara! 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 Fight for me now! Open your mouth and talk to the mighty God. Come on, mama, 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 mama. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Hey! Zalaba, ba, 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 ba. Zalaba, ba, 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 ba. Zalaba, ba, 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 ba. Zalaba, ba, 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 ba. Hey! Galaba, shantala. Zale, katole, brahe, kata. Ko, kate, kazunda, labo, shantalia. Rogoro, gezita, labrande, kasantali. Jegele, kaka, baba. Kabale Basutalia, Skete, Kakab La Bosca. Thank you, Father. Hey, Jesus, mighty name, we are praying. Lift up your way and say, Father. Oh my God, you can do better. Say, Father. Every enemy that have refused to leave me alone. Oh Lord, by fire. By fire, consume them now. Open your mouth and talk to the mighty God. Kaka ba 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 ba. Aha, 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 
Aha, masata la 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 la. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. That's it, that's it, that's it. That's it, masuka la bau. She pull the papa la ba 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 ba. Aha, palima santo libraga. Je le 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 kasunta lia. Break eke mama mama. Si pale gagusa pa. She pull the ba 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 ba. Break eke le boss katalia. Break a kababa. Ke le branda kasanta lia. Ma santa la bakata. Kaka ba 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 ba. Ke le boss kata. Hey Jesus, mighty day we are praying. Lift up your voice, say Father. You can do better. Say Father. All the forces pursuing my destiny, all the powers of my father's house pursuing my destiny. What are you waiting for? Die by fire. Open your mouth and touch the magic door. Anyone pursuing your destiny, let them die by fire. 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 Ah, mali pa 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 pa. Jelelele gasuta liam. Ro ka 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 ka. Zalekete gasuta liam. Rakata gasanta liam. Ro pa pa le baba. Jelelele gasuta. Lik aku ka ka ka. Maragade gasuta. Jelelele gasuta liam. Better talk to the Lord. Better talk to the Lord. Better talk to the law. Better talk to the law. Kaka ba 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 ba. Kaka ba 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 ba. Kaka ba 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 ba. Kara ba 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 ba. Zaleka tagajenta. Hey Jesus, my tine, we are praying. Lift up your twin and say, My father, my father, my father. You are my fighter. Ara. Let me see my enemy no more. Go ahead and talk to the Almighty God. I will see them no more. I will see them no more. The man li pate gaga. Oh, my ri papa, mama, mama, mama. Let me see them no more. Is somebody praying at all? Karaba baskala. Salaga gaga gaga. Kaka balaboskata. Skele brande kasata. In Jesus, mighty name, we are praying. You want to pray the dangerous one? Lift up your two hands. Say, oh, fire of God. You are going to say seven times. When you finish saying seven times, you say, scatter the covers of witches and wizards. Scatter satanic altars. Scatter many kingdoms and set me free. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Holy Ghost fire. Say loud and clear. Say with all your strength. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Scatter! Open your mouth and talk to the magic God. Scatter the covers of witches and wizards. <laughs> Scatter satanic altars. <laughs> Scatter the Mary Kingdom. Fire of God. Massacre la 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 la. Raka ka 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 ka. Set us free. Masutalale. Gagabale. Gazutalia. Let the fire walk against the enemy. Sapole ba 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 ba. Zele gaguza pale mashantale. Zazale ke tegezeta. Shipole gazita li mama. Kore ba 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 ba. Kashenta, 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 Kashenta. Zalimas Kachelia. Ah ah. Kalimas Swantalis. Hey, Purbobobosca. Zalimas Kachelia. Kakabashete. Zeke Liba Santalis. Thank you, Father. In Jesus, mighty name, we are praying. Little of those words. Mm. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Zamalibo Santalia. Hey, Pasuta, Lika Pandalia. Ropote, Gazuta, Balika Palianda. Enemy fighting you unknown to you. 
zi aka kaka paka kuka jeke teke teka suka la braka katalala wherever they are hiding <laughs> wherever is their stronghold <laughs> let the thunder of god scatter them in the name of jesus your victory will not be partial your victory will not be incomplete every power pursue your destiny die by fire every enemy that have refused to leave you alone that has sworn that over their dead bodies let them be buried it doesn't matter how long this battle has been I stand upon this altar you will see them no more again in that about Jesus we turn the battle to the Lord we turn the battles of our life to the Lord we turn the battles of our life to the Lord spiritual battles are physical battles are financial battles are material battles are marital battles are let go fire and so shall live in the name of God the Father God the Son God the Holy Spirit lift up your offering every of your financial battles I use your seed as a point of contact God will give you complete victory over poverty I stand as the servant of the most high God God will not permit poverty to reign over your life whatever God needs to do for you to pray through financially let it be a settled matter today in the name of Jesus. And so shall it be. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. And the people of God will say, it better. Beloved, just as we have been announcing, our program continues later tonight. It's five to six. Uh, there will be no digging deep. It is still the same prayer program that will stand in for digging deep. And uh, my prayer is that. God will do what he needs to do for our second half to be better than first half. And tomorrow morning, the program still continue, and we encourage every one of us to fast. We encourage every one of us to pray. Pray uh, Fasting without prayer is hunger strike. So find time to pray, even as you are waiting, even before we meet in the evening. And by the time we come in the evening, uh, we we'll crown it under corporate anointing. And the Lord will answer us in Jesus' name. What is the timing? Five to six, not six to seven or six thirty. Five to six. And as you come, come with expectation. The grace.